can't believe that I'm hearing it. Yes. You know, it's true. You know I'm not with the woman that I truly love. You know I'm not with the woman that's in my heart. I should be with you. I should be with you and Jane and little Ethan. I've only got myself to blame. Not too late. We can have it all. We can be a family. We love each other. And that's what matters. These tears are I'm so lost, I can't be found. I'm on a road to nowhere. I'm on a road. You see? Now, finally, we can be together. Finally. I mean, you've always belonged with me and with Ethan and Jane. We're already a family, Ethan, and I've got, I've got plans. I've got lots of plans. You can move into Mama's house tonight, and in a little bit we can, no, we Teresa, can look for a no, place no, for our No, 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 no. I don't know what. No. You can't. I'm married to Gwen. I, I, I know. I can't. I made vows to her in church, Teresa. I've made a commitment to her. You know me, and I can't... I'm the kind of man that can just break his word. Gwen doesn't deserve that. Uh, what about me, Ethan? What about our child, Ethan? You have chosen Gwen over our daughter and her future happiness. No. I've not done that. And don't you use our daughter as a bargaining chip. Do you think that I want to? No, I think you want what I want. For us to be together. But it can't be. Why? Why not? It... Wait. You just admit it. That's what you want. Don't make this harder. Don't make this harder than it is. Teresa, I need your promise. I need your promise that we're going to work together to make Jane's upbringing as peaceful as we can make it. I want her to know that her mommy and daddy care about each other. Even though they don't live with each other. I wanted to know that, that she was created out of, out of love, Teresa. No, Ethan, you, you didn't even know it was me you were with that night when we created Jane, and because I disguised myself as Gwen. How stupid do you think I am? Of course I knew it was you that night.